In this example problem, we're given three masses in kilograms, and we're asked to convert those masses into pounds. Now, the conversion factor we're going to use to do this is going to be 2.2 pounds per one kilogram. So by multiplying each of these masses by that conversion factor, we'll get our masses in pounds. So first we have 15 kilograms. We're going to multiply it by 2.2 pounds per one kilogram. The kilograms will cancel and we're left with 15 times 2.2 pounds. Now we'll come over here and do that multiplication. 15 times 2.2, 2 times 5 is 10, 2 times 1 is 2 plus 1 is 3, 2 times 5 is 10, 2 times 1 plus 1 is 3. So this gives us 33 kilograms. I'm sorry, 33 pounds. So our second number is 28.5 kilograms. We'll multiply it once again by our conversion factor of 2.2 pounds per one kilogram. Kilograms cancel once again, and we have 28.5 times 2.2 pounds. So we'll come over here and do our multiplication. 28.5 times 2.2. 2 times 5 is 10, 2 times 8 is 16, plus 1 is 17, 2 times 2 is 4, plus 1 is 5. So we're going to have the same numbers repeated one decimal place over to the left. And now we'll add these up, and we get 62.7. So this is equivalent to 62.7 pounds. Our final mass is 58.1 kilograms. Multiply it one more time by our conversion factor, 2.2 pounds per one kilogram. The units cancel and we have 58.1 times 2.2 pounds. One more time, we're gonna to have to do the multiplication. So we have 58.1 times 2.2. 2 times 1 is 2, 2 times 8 is 16, 2 times 5 is 10, plus 1 is 11. And once again, this is just going to be the same pattern of numbers repeated one place to the left. So we'll add these up, 2, 8, 7, 2, 1. So 58.1 kilograms is the same as 127.82 pounds.